short video coming up of me demonstrating the vertical draw test, sometimes known as the Lachman's test. We're pinching that from the Lachman's test for ACL integrity in the knee. And it's basically, it's an up-down test of the second toe on the metatarsal head, typically the second toe. And we're looking to take that toe and move it directly up and directly down, which you shouldn't really want to do. It will often be a little bit attenuated distally, as in the case for this patient on the video coming up next. So this young lady has got quite a marked bunion deformity and a hammer toe, some PIPJ flexion here and a metatarsophalangeal joint hyperextension. So Joe, where's the worst of your pain? Is it the bunion, the hammer toe or the knuckle back here? It's the ball of the foot. So it's underneath. <laughs> yeah. So what we'll just demonstrate is that this lady, and we've already scanned it so we know, has actually got a partial plate disruption. So we're going to do a Lachman's test. Let me see if I can show that a bit better for the camera. So that really moves up. So if you can see at that point there, I'll just use one of my anaesthetic testing devices. They look a little bit like a biro. <laughs> And you can actually, you can write with them as well. They're really handy. I got them from America. They're about $200. So that's the joint. And that, that joint, Joe, should only really rotate. Yours is coming up and down a ways. And you, hopefully you can see it on the video. But yours is actually sore, isn't it, when we, when yeah. we press up there. Um, these are the ones we avoid putting steroid in. Thanks for that little video, Joe. Treatment would depend on the presentation, would be broadly along the lines of taping and conservative measures. I'm not a fan of injection therapy for these because I think they will further loosen the capsule and surgical measures and that's what this patient is going to go forward and have. Thank you.